So here's an exclusive interview with Ratchinok in Tannon when we caught up with her for Nevermind the Shuttlecocks at the All English Open Championships. Ratchinok, thank you so much for agreeing to have a quick interview with us on Nevermind the Shuttlecocks. Um, my first question, ahead of your 2013 final against Tina Bao, how nervous were you? Uh, if you ask about my nervous, I actually that time I was feel almost 100% that I can be a champion or what, but I know that because from, from the past, I, I won her and I just believe that on that day I can win her again, but she played quite well and like she prepared very good game and try to play everything like that we know that she say will be her last competition in her life. Yeah. So course. also pressure myself that I also don't want to lose things and I feel more like not not my nature. I suppose as well you're probably quite proud as well because you were 18 I think so yeah. that's an amazing achievement and then obviously you went on to win the world championships just sort of a few few a little while later how amazing was that to win at just 18 to win the world championships uh, actually I also don't 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 think that I will be the champion on the 18 become the world champion on that time I just think that I just do my best and also I play with the uh, world number one and also in the China. Mm. Then I think just if I have to lose him, I have to lose the boy is caused with with her like fifteen uh fifteen more the boy so I just uh, I just do my best but yeah. I can I also don't believe that I can become the world champion. Okay, but but it I mean it must have been amazing to to become world champion, right? That's yeah. That incredible. that time is is like dreaming after winning. I yeah, after like winning, how did you <laughs> how did you feel? Just amazing, I guess. Yeah, amazing, and also like, huh? That <laughs> I can become the yeah, of course. <laughs> I think that's a natural a natural reaction. Um, what would it mean to you to win the All England this week? Obviously. You've come so close in the past. What would it mean to you to win this week? The Oregon is the most old competition like have many years and I think that many players want to become the champion in here and also I also the one of them that I want to become the champion but I I got to final in here but still cannot become the champion. So I think that this year I just do my best. But I believe that every player is not is not uh, easy or what because every player training harder and we all have the dream and also the target. Yeah, and it and the women's singles has got so many amazing players in at the moment. Um, who would you say is sort of the, the toughest uh, opponent on the tour? Who's your toughest opponent? Uh, like we, we play each other many times and we learn what is the, the strong point and also weakness of uh, like each other and also depend on that they who can control ourselves and who can control everything on the game. Yeah. I think that will, will be the winning. Yeah, you don't want to say who is the toughest opponent, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I suppose, as you say, you play each other so much, you, yeah. you see each other's games so closely. Um, you're still only 25, which is amazing. Um, what are your goals for sort of the year ahead? Are you thinking just about the All England or are you looking ahead to the Olympics? Uh, I'm looking in every tournament that I just think that at least I have to enter uh, quarter final and like step by step. Yeah. And Oregon is also the my target to become the champion and also the Olympic game also. Mm -hmm. 
What do you do to relax away from the away from the court and away from badminton? What do you do to relax? My relax when I like free time. I just yeah. I just sometimes watching the Netflix. Yeah. Oh. What's your favorite show? Uh, just any what is the new one? So yeah, I just nice. Watch, yeah, 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 I'm the same. Yeah. I just anything that they put on, I just end yeah, up watching. And sometimes also went out to walking with family or yeah, nice. eating outside. Yeah. Um, have you ever read or watched the Harry Potter films? Have you watched Harry Potter films? How are you? Harry Potter? <laughs> Harry Potter? <laughs> Harry Potter? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Harry Potter. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, I, I, I who, watch Who's your before. favorite character in Harry Potter, and who is the character you're most like? Harry Potter. Harry Potter, <laughs> yeah, main main character. I like that. Yeah. I like that a lot. Yeah. I like that a lot. Yeah. That would be. I think I'd probably be a similar answer. Or Neville Longbottom. Do you know Neville? No, no. no. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting a bit. I'm getting a Harry Potter Only geek no, now. Harry Potter. Yeah, just Harry Potter. No, that's fair enough. Um, What's your favourite English meal? So when you come over for the All England, what's your favourite meal? My favourite meal? Burger. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Great answer! What, with cheese and everything? Proper, proper stacked uh, up? Only chicken. Oh, only chicken? Only no, that's chicken. fine. Totally fine. <laughs> yeah. Have you... Uh, KFC, yeah? Or yeah, Nando's? Yeah, yeah. Have you been to Nando's? Huh? Have you been to Nando's? It's a restaurant. N Nando, Nando's. No, no, no. I, I, I think I, I never, I never been there. You've got to go to Nando's. Okay. That's the I, one. I try, I try. <laughs> Let's <laughs> Okay. That's great. Thank you so much for your time, Ratchanok, and ha. good luck this week. Ha. Okay. Thank you. Have a good